Sebastian, uh, Sebastian, what have you bought me? I, I've been doing my job, Jesse. I haven't been out here shopping, but there, there are plenty of deals to be had. You know, it's just after 10 o'clock. That means that this store has been open for eight hours. One of the many retailers really uh, leaning in to this day before Black Friday deals. Black Friday continues to gray. This year, the doorbuster deals starting at some stores before any turkey is served. I will usually wait till the last minute. <laughs> so today was just an experience and it wasn't bad. Plano based JC Penny isn't taking the day off this Thanksgiving. At this North Dallas location, doors opened at two in the afternoon. Customers just kept coming. A retailer that's coming off a rough few years. In 2017, they closed 138 locations across the country. This is the company worked to refocus its image. Well, I have to say, when we pulled into this parking lot today, we said, oh my goodness, <laughs> because there's hardly a spot open. So it seems busier this year. <laughs> Kim Radiki and the Black Friday Divas of Dallas should know. They face the crowds every year for the last five years. Today, that meant an early dinner. Spending time with family, and that's what we like most about it. J.C. Penny isn't the only option on the holiday. Down the street, Best Buy shoppers were playing the long game, camping out for their shot at savings. TVs are usually the first to go. It makes it crazy, but I like it because you get really good deals. Best Buy will close at 1 in the morning, while J.C. Penny won't close, period. Expect them to stay open through the night until 10 p.m. On, on Black Friday. So a handful of retailers are trying this, extending those hours the day before Black Friday, but Black Friday is still king by all accounts, still the biggest retail day in the United States, and it has been since 2005. Back to you. All right, Sebastian Robertson for us. Thank you, Sebastian.